Maguire to depart as well. we see confirmation of those changes on the screen for you. So Six goals for the season, a brace on Wednesday night. As New York came so close to ending the three days. April the 22nd, since their last three points. Well, it's just a, a, straight, a straightforward tackle that would probably lead to a maul, I would probably <laughs> say. Stadium like that atmosphere that day. This is O'Toole, tussling. And for Gio, Giovanni Savarese. Window reopens, this is the New York free kick, and that's Parks! And it's 1-1 at Providence Park as Keaton Parks right. He goes in, he is onside. It's a wonderful ball because that's at a perfect height at the near stick. Dallas Cannon. Well, we've got a good game set up for this second half then. If you're staying up late, step of course now of New York City as O'Toole lifts it in. Magno is underneath it. Oh, it's tipped away by the keeper. Turned back in by Pellegrini and cleared away. Drop to New York City SC player. Zuperic. Gray underneath it again. And in league and cup until tonight. Barraza on the bench. And Portland now coming again. And it's Mosquera. He's lining this one up. It's off O'Toole. Parks with the header away. Bully trying to get underneath it. Still trying to work it for Frank Bolly. That's a lovely touch. And in the six yard box, won the ball. Inside the last half hour at Providence Park, it's 1 1. Portland and New York City FC, the same. So deceptive, and he's got such tight control. Maybe not every touch was on purpose, but it was enough that it was tight to his body. It's these moments where he can be at his best, and where he really starts to influence the game. And he, he almost stands taller than some of his teammates on the field. He's the. He's the the engine is in a sense that everything's going and for Bravo Portland trying to move back into the ascendancy just Tavon Gray with the header away Kalaskin nods it back Gray once more is in that's very much from Micha Ilinic Started life as a winger in his career. Rodriguez finds Stylus Magno. Rodriguez hits it! And he would... Running down that right-hand channel. Just needed that ball played into an area. Puts the ball. Nobody really running it behind for you. What's important, and he said, that we play in transition. And when we do go, when we win the ball, we got to go quickly. we got to be effective, because that's when we're facing forward and we're looking to be direct. And they get set up in the front half and, and they possessed. Everything's in front of the defense last year, but wasn't quite right. This, since he last played New York City FC, left and then rejoins with, with the club. It's as though he, he's really full on back with the team. What a boost it would be if you can get Felipe Mora back to full strength, back to what he showed that season in 2021. Of minutes really last year, meaningful minutes. Ten months out with a second procedure on the knee. Something different for the Timbers. He's clever and he's ruthless, Tony. So good with the positions he takes up. Callas again, the cross from the drop. It's a mistake from Freeze, but Hack, well done to the defender because he was there to clean things up. experience of the German German born but former US men's national team player Rodriguez with the cross into the penalties that wet December day game that was dramatic right to the end Is and that's a firm header from Justin Hack. What a header that is from Hack. That back three, they're positioning. They are four unbeaten. The road record, five draws, five defeats. No victories, though. 
Brace header. Kalaskin using his body and he's fouled through the back. Oh, and it was Moraga over the spectacular. And now the break on. And Jason can bring it away for New York City. How bold can they be with Pellegrini through the middle? 